Today on MTG Unpacked, we're getting stuck into three Walmart or Maya chaos boxes. So what do you find in these? For $13.99 US, you get three draft boost packs, one foil promo, and usually it's a bunch of junk. So I saw these on Saturday at my local Maya store, and they were actually gathering dust. So I thought, you know what? The uh, viewers of my channel seem to appreciate watching me get hosed from these, so I thought I would pick some up, and let's see what we get for the promo. So we got a Foil Calamity Bearer Pringle, worth about 20 cents. Okay. Oh, ho, ho! hello! Dominaria Remastered. Okay. Well, I still don't take back everything I said about these. They don't often put Dominaria Remastered in here. But that is a pretty unexpected pack, to be honest. I don't think I've pulled one out of here before. Starting off with Mystic Zealot. Lightning Reflexes. Deep Analysis Werebear. Ridgetop Raptor. Elvish Aberration. Leaden Fist. Goblin Turncoat, yes, Goblin Action, White Mane, Lion, Uncommons, Tiana, Ships, Caretaker, and what is this? Assault and Battery, okay. Zombie Infestation, and will we get a Force of Will? We get Maze of Earth, okay, that's not too bad. Along with Peregrine Drake, a Plains, and a Squirrel Token. On to some Kamigawa Neon Dynasty. So, Bosiju. We want to find that, don't we? We have Ecologist Terrarium. Greater Tanuki. Cyber Trespassers. What is up with the focus here? Moth Rider Patrol. Tawashi Song Shaper. Kaito's Pursuit. Commune with Spirits. Imperial Subduer. Jukai Preserver. And the Okiba Reckoner Raid Rats in Leather Jackets. Let's take a look at the other side. Nozumi Road Captain and Acquisition Octopus for the Uncommons. Secluded Courtyard. That is still around the bar. Not too shabby. Only Cult Anvil and Reckoner Bankbuster. Actually, I think this one is one of the hits these days. And we have a Swamp. Fantastic artwork on that Swamp and a Samurai Token. And Battle Bond. Okay, so if you're going to get one of these and it has Dominaria Remastered and Battle Bond, I honestly don't think you can do too much better than that. Let's go with Battle Bond. We have Doomed Dissenter, Claustrophobia, Urborg Drake, Ember Beast, Saddleback Lagak, Omen Speaker, Daggerback Basilisk, Millennial Gargoyle, Battle Rampart, a Spirit Token. Mountain and a Mythic, Archfiend of Despair, and I think that is one of the bulkier Mythics. We also have Loyal Pegasus, Inner Demon, The Crowd Goes Wild, and Shoulder to Shoulder. Okay, so the pulls, not too bad for that first one. Let's see what we can do in box number two. And I'm thinking this one will probably have, like, Crimson Vow, Streets of New Capenna, something like that. All the uh, packs they're trying to get rid of. Okay, so what do we got? Oh, nice! Nyx Lotus. I will take that. So, nice promo card there. Looks pretty flat. Okay, that one will probably end up on TCG Player. Link in the corner to my TCG Player store. Streets of New Capenna, and by the way, I do get a small portion of sales from purchases from that link, just to make you aware. Okay, Streets of New Capenna, we have Make Disappear, Backup Agent, Wrecking Crew, Glittermonger, Deal Gone Bad, Witness Protection, Prize Fight, Demon's Jew, Expendable Lackey, and Nimble Larcenist for the Uncommons, River Tears, Decoy, Whack! And Jetmere's Garden! Okay, I'll take that. So a nice Triome pool with the showcase art. Pretty cool. Foil Corrupt Court Official. And a Forest and Ogre Warrior token. Okay, next up we have D&D Baldur's Gate. Okay, so this set is the one everyone was ragging on last year. So see if we can... 
do okay out of it at least. We have a Dire Mimic. You don't often see the Mimics looking like that. Contact other plane, Ingenious Artillerist, Parasitic Impetus, Pegasus Garden. Garden. Pegasus Guardian, yes. Scaled Nurturer. Run away together, Warehouse Thief, Ghastly Death Tyrant, Scouting Hawk, Etta Cap, Psychic Impetus, Faceless One, and by the way, you are supposed to draft these packs. In Commander, we've got Emoin, Mystic Trickster, Giant Ankeg, Ghost Lantern, and Ragga Dragga, Gorgut's Boss for the rare, Cloakwood Hermit, and Mirror of Life Trapping, okay, another rare. Foil, Zentarum, Bandit, and another Squirrel. Okay, so what is this interesting pack? What the heck? Shut the front door. We've got... We've got a Double Masters 2022. What? Oh, okay. I wrecked the card trick. We've got Carador, Ghost Chieftain, a Mythic. We'll set that aside. Terriel, Reckoner of Souls. Nice. And Goblin Banneret, along with Sultai, Soothsayer, Graveblade, Marauder, Is it Charm, Ether Snipe, Eye Blight's Ending, and we will get some foils here as well. Stay tuned. Sensor Splicer, Jeskai, Elder, Stormfleet, Pyromancer, Annoyed, Ultasaur, Call to the Feast, and a Boar Token, Cryptic Spires, and a Foil Call to the Feast. Okay. And Pirate's Pillage. All right, so Double Masters 2022. Come on, MJ Holding. What are you doing? Did you juice up that final run of these boxes? Normally, they're done with these by now, and they would be uh, getting the Autumn ones ready. What do we got for a promo card? Okay, Lethral Blade of the Elves. Pringle. Okay, so that is a Mythic. So what are the packs here? Oh, yep, there we go. Crimson Vow. This is more like what I expect to see in these. This is why I don't recommend you pick these up. Leave it out in the comments, though. What did you find in these? If you were silly enough to get any, let's go with Griff Rider, Reckless Impulse, Fear of Death, Adamant Will, Diagraph Scavenger, Flourishing Hunter, Persistent Specimen, Blood Servitor, Siphon Essence and Binding Geist, Diver Scarb, and we're skipping over the uh, double-sided ones in these. There's so many. Skull Scarb, Alluring Suitor, and Creepy Puppeteer, along with an Island, and Add Card, and a Blank Day-Night Token. All right, Midnight Hunt. Here we go. So this is the typical slap in the face you can expect. The two sets that nobody really wants to see when they open these boxes. We have Crawl from the Cellar that is creepy as Jewel for Dominance, Stuffed Bear, Storm Rider Spirit, No Way Out, Bramble Armor, Defenestrate, Unruly Mob, Immolation, Tyler's Hauler, Scarb Wrangler, Clear Shot, Flame Channeler, was that okay? I'm not sure. And Augur of Autumn for the rare. We've got a forest and an awesome looking elemental token. One more pack to crack. Okay, so Ixalan. Not too shabby. At least it wasn't another Streets of New Capenna. Final pack magic. Let's go. We have Legion Conquistador. Mark of the Vampire. Frenzied Raptor. River Herald's Boon. Prosperous Pirate. Spell Pierce. Territorial Hammer Skull. Windstrider. Hierophant's Chalice, Costly Plunder, and Perilous Voyage, along with Savage Stomp, Marauding Looter, and Shaper's Sanctuary for the rare. Also got an Island, and Treasure Token. And if you want to see something awesome, way more awesome than this, check out our journey through Magic History. We open one of every pack, going all the way back to Antiquities. Link in the corner to that one. I'll be updating that series real soon with some new sets. Hope everyone's staying safe and healthy out there. Thanks for watching and have a great day.